Hello, I'm uh, Yoshinori Ono, uh, producer of Street Fighter Cross Tekken. I'm here at Gamescom this year to show off the latest build of the game. It includes four new characters. Uh, the game's systems are very close to final, uh, so it's a really great version. Hope you all enjoy it. I can continue my journey. I think. Okay, I'll talk about the two brand new ones that we're just announcing here at Gamescom. Uh, first of all, we have Kuma, the bear from Tekken. I feel that Kuma is, uh, you know, A, uh, certainly a popular character in Tekken, a character that a lot of people have been asking about. We're very happy to uh, answer their call for this character. And secondly, he's uh, long been a kind of a symbol of what Tekken really is. These kind of wacky characters like Kuma and Panda, uh, they, they really cut to the core of what the essence of Tekken really is. And I think that by putting him in the game, hopefully I can reassure a lot of the Tekken fans that yes, we do get it. We do know what's going on with Tekken. We're listening to what's going on and we understand what you like about it. Uh, so very happy to bring Kuma into the game. The other character we're announcing here is Ibuki. Uh, once again, another very popular a fan favorite from the Street Fighter stable. Uh, happy to bring her along from Street Fighter 4, where she made her most recent appearance. Uh, you know, a character with a long and storied history, and I hope people continue to play as her into the future. And the other two brand new characters we're announcing are Hugo. Uh, you know, we are in Germany right now, so it's our pleasure to announce the first German character uh, from the Street Fighter stable in this game. Uh, also, you know, of course, we announced Poison a little earlier this year at Comic-Con, and where there's Poison, there's Hugo. Uh, so they're kind of a pair, they're a set. Uh, glad to bring him along for the ride. Uh, and then from the Tekken side, we have Raven. Um, you know, once again, a fan favorite from the Tekken side, an oft-requested character. Uh, very happy to bring that to the fans who want to play as, as Raven. Um, you know, we did give uh, GameSpot the exclusive uh, one day ahead of time uh, trailer, and we're already getting a lot of responses from fans who are really happy about Raven's inclusion. So, uh, yeah, some, some really fun character announcements this time around. Yeah, the, uh, you know, the gameplay system in Street Fighter Cross Deck that I'm personally most excited about and the one that I think will uh, really get fans excited as well is the Cross Assault system. This allows you to have two characters on the screen at once, um, which was really exciting and very unique uh, and specific for this title. Uh, you know, when I say that uh, the game system is almost finalized, what I really mean is that we have all the different kinds of systems finalized. We know what's going in. Uh, as for the specifics, you know, there's still a lot of fine-tuning to go. I like to use these kind of events as a chance to communicate with the fans, get feedback from them. You know, we did the same thing at Comic-Con and E3 plan on doing it at Gamescom and, and all the events that are left up until launch. Uh, so you know, all those specifics uh, that will go into those systems, you know, we still have a lot of data to collect and a lot of opinions to get from people, uh, but we know what's going in and the cross assault system of the ones that are going in is the one I'm personally most excited about. Okay, so basically the way the current system is implemented in, in, in the build we're using right now, it's a very simple implementation. You do the Hadouken motion and uh, three button presses, and you call the other character in. Uh, the way it's set up as it is, is I make uh, one hit with my one character, controls automatically switch to the other guy, uh, and then it keeps going back and forth and you take turns round robin style uh, as you do your combos. Now whether that'll be the final incarnation of the system, I don't know. You know, we're still looking to uh, hear feedback from people that are playing the game. If there's a better way to go about it, we're certainly willing to try it. Uh, you know, I'm very anxious to hear if people find this user friendly or not. There's a good chance that the next time we show the game off at TGS or at some other global uh, trade show, it might actually be a little different uh, because we're not necessarily married to this. It's one that we like, but if there's better stuff out there, we're more than happy to hear people's opinion on it. Yeah, so it has been a real challenge in getting these uh, these characters from different uh, worlds, so to speak, to play nicely together and to uh, behave properly in a well-balanced game. Uh, you know, there were a lot of avenues we could have taken. We could have taken the Tekken characters and Street Fighterized them, so to speak, uh, but then there'd be no point in putting them in. It'd be a Street Fighter game. We could have taken the opposite track and, uh, you know, made the Street Fighter characters play more like Tekken characters, but once again, there's no point to that. And the third option is not much better, which would be taking, you know, literally a half-and-half -half kind of situation, having a meet in the middle, but then you just get this watered-down sort of game that doesn't uh, feel like anything. So we decided we actually had to create a brand new stage, if you will, uh, and just start from scratch and make a brand new game system, bring the Tekken characters on board, bring the Street Fighter characters on board, and balance them uh, in this new sort of gameplay system. That's been working pretty well so far. Yeah, it's great to be here in Cologne, great city. I love being here. Came here last year, used to come to Leipzig when we had the show out there. Uh, you know, it's very clear to me that uh, the, the German fans really, really love fighting games. And not just Street Fighter, uh, they like Tekken as well, which is great, so do I. Uh, so I'm really happy to, uh, to bring this game to these guys. Uh, really anxious to have you guys come on in, get your hands on the game, let me know what you think. Um, I think it's something you're really going to enjoy, and I encourage you to give it a shot.